Tree Hall, you know, and it's going to be a talk through, so get ready. So it's just basically where I'm going to place things in my home and what I use it for and who wears this and when we're going to try those out. Okay, so first off, if you're new to my channel, I'm Andrea Michelle. I'm behind the camera and I welcome you to my channel. Definitely go and check out some of my vlogs. I have a lot of mixture of everything, hauls, uh, DIYs. Just a lot of stuff on my channel. If you like, go ahead and subscribe to my channel and definitely hit that thumbs up button and turn on your nah, turn on your post notification and get all of my updates on my vlogs on your chat on your phone, not your channel, but on your phone, um, so you can know when I post everything. But anywho. I basically was on a budget, you guys. You know, I'm starting to like go a little lower on my budget for Dollar Tree and 99 because I've really been hitting the under budget mark. So for Dollar Tree, um, normally my budget would be $20. Um, but this time I set my budget for a measly $10. And I, I was just like so shocked because I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight products. And it was only nine something. So I was really under budget a little bit by a dollar and some coins. But I got to put that back in my purse. She got to put that back in her purse, okay? So I was just walking around Dollar Tree and I was just scoping out a lot of stuff. They don't have a lot of, like a lot of new stuff, not a lot of new product. But I found a couple of new things that I didn't see from my last trip to the Dollar Tree. So basically it's these little houses and these are decor houses. They don't have like the little thing where you can set them up like for you know picture frames or whatever but I got this one it says home sweet home with the home on top and I really adore this this would be ideal for like an entryway so when people come in or your family come in they can be like oh relax and stuff when they see this sign it says home sweet home you know you're home okay and um it's really inviting and you're whoever comes into your home uh, preferably people you know um, they're going to be asking you where did you get this from girl you can tell them or you don't have to tell them okay you can tell them you got it from Pure One or something you know uh, Marshalls or Ross or TJ Maxx or Burlington things in that nature you don't really have to say oh Dollar Tree because most of the time when I tell people I most of the time when I tell people I got it at the Dollar Tree and they go try to find it, I'm like, you lying. I'm like, no, I'm not. I got it at the Dollar Tree, you guys. Um, so, um, yeah, m most people think I'm lying about it, but um, they will have to wait like a while before they can get their hands on these. And then they'd be like searching like everywhere for it. Um, on these, I don't like this brown. I love like the whole gray concept. So I want to try to find some more of the gray color. I'm not, I know I'm not going to come close to that gray, but I wanted to just kind of finish it out through it. Um, I love the farmhouse vibe, but I just love that gray. So I want to try to like DIY it and finish it. Um, if I don't find that, then I'll do it a silver uh, kind of color, silver grayish kind of color. Um, and I've um, kind of looked at into targets and finding some um, some color um, that I can do it. And they have like little um, crafty pins that you can do this with, like markers. So I'm going to try to find that. And targets is the best place to get that if you are a crafter or like to do DIYs. So yeah, I got two of these. One for my entryway, which is really small. I have a really small um, condo. My living room is small, but my upstairs in my room is really huge. And I wish it was like turned around where my bedroom was really my living room and my living room was my bedroom because I really don't care about a big bedroom. Um, but yeah, I'm going to have one for downstairs and then one for upstairs in my hall because I have like a vanity where my um, where my stairs in and I can just put that there. Um, and yeah, so... If you wanted to, you can go ahead and put that in your kitchen too as well or on your bar. It will look so cute. Um, and then I found the Spa Naturals Vitamin E Beauty uh, uh, Beauty Oil for smoother, softer skin. I would definitely recommend you use this after bath. 
or at the shower because when you put it on before it's like so literally so I know it's oil but it's so greasy to the skin and it's very moisturizing don't get me wrong it, it's very moisturizing but I would rather put this on after my bath or after my shower because it feels so good and you can get all that that moisture in after your bath so before I wouldn't definitely put this on like dirty skin but after like I say after your bath and stuff like that and you can also I know it says for body but you can also use it for oh pew. you say hi, hi. get in the light where we can see ya can we see ya yeah we can see ya good morning Ashton how are you this Monday morning? Good. <laughs> you want to say hi to the people? Yes. Say hi. hi. Wait. Do you have any advice for the people for Monday? Do you have any motivation quotes? What's motivation quotes? Oh, Lord Jesus. To tell them something uplifting. Like, have a wonderful day. If anyone brings you down, make sure you pick yourself back up. But don't tear them down. Do better than them. And be better than them. Right? Yeah. So if somebody bring you down, what do you do? You get right back. Up. Yes. So that's what we're telling the people. If somebody try to bring you down, you, you better down. get back up. Okay? And if they fall down, make sure you help them up. Okay? Okay. Because that's the way God would want us all to do. Uh -huh. Okay. So, I also recommend that you use this for your hair as well. Yeah, it says body. Don't be fooled. You can use this for your hair. I use these for my edges. And I only use a little bit, so I stick my hand inside of there because it doesn't have, like, a spray bottle or anything. So, I just stick my hand in there and just kind of pat my edges, you know, with it. And, girl, yes, I've been feeling life with my edges. So, but yes, you can use this for your hair. I wouldn't recommend to use this for cooking purpose because that would be so like nasty and this is not for that purpose. But anywho, or anyways, <laughs> um, yeah, you can, this is really good. Um, and also I do use this on my lips at night too to moisturize my lips um, for the morning um, when I put my Vaseline on my lips. So yeah, I will definitely like put a little bit on this. Vitamin E oil is really good. Every lady needs to have some of this in her purse on the go. So if you feel like you're a little bit ashy, yes girl. Like I'm a little ashy around the finger here. <laughs> um, so yeah, we need to carry this in our purses. And men too, especially if you have like beards and stuff like that, you can definitely put this on there. Um, in your hair, you can put this in there to make it shiny. Um, body wise too as well but yeah um i love 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 this inspire premium mega moisturizing body wash sm uh, skin smoothing shea butter um body wash and this is the 18 full ounce um and look what it says compared ingredients to um ole ultra moisture body um uh, body wash so that is really good this is going to be really good for you it smells nice um, and I use this. I always compare these two together. Stop AJJ. Stop pumpkin. It's supposed to be like this. No, it's not supposed to be like that. It's supposed to be like, like But um, I use these two together, so I will definitely go in and wash my body with this. It makes a lot of bubbles and suds. If you're wondering, does bubbles? it make a lot of bubbles? I, bubbles? I know you love bubbles, boo. So if you want like a bath time or something like that, or a spa time, just you and your boo, or just you by yourself, girl. Um, this will make a lot of bubbles and it smells so freaking good. Um, and afterwards, use your, um, Spa Natural Vitamin E Beauty Oil because it feels so freaking good together. Um, I have my charger in, so don't, don't, don't mind that card. <laughs> um, then I bought AJJ some socks. You guys know I love their socks. They come out like with some new colored socks. They do have like little, um, strings hanging out. But yeah, it come, just comes right out. Or sometimes you just cut it out. But I love these because they fit him so well. I don't have to spend a ton of money on socks for him. I just go straight to the Dollar Tree. These are more his play socks. And don't don't mind me. I do. He does have dressy socks and white socks that I buy him from Target or from Ross or wherever I can find a good deal on socks. Um, 
but these are more his play socks and um he can get these dirty or he can keep them clean whichever um but they do last a long time i can say that and you get definitely get for little kids three pair per pack and like i said i love them they feel great on his feet they come in all different kind of colors um and yeah they're for a dollar three packs uh three pack of socks i mean it is bomb like he got six pair of socks for two dollars like that's crazy, okay? You go to a regular store and get these socks for 6 or $7, you know, for just three pairs. So, um, yeah, I just love going to Dollar Tree for that. Don't, um, I know I got like one finger painted. They're about to get done today. <laughs> but, um, but don't sleep on the kids' socks at Dollar Tree because they are really good. And I love it. So, like, AJJ in his sock drawer, he has a whole lot of Dollar Tree socks. So, whenever I can get my hands on some, like, Handsome socks. I'm going to stop saying cute with my son, but handsome socks for him. Um, I definitely um, get a lot of them. Um, so they only had like two packs that I really liked for him. And I try to go with a lighter color for my son. Um, so any like white socks or whatever, you know, kids, they're rough on them. They come back dirty. You wash them. It's still dirty and sometimes you can't get the dirt out of them so that's why I try to go for these kind of socks but he does have um, white socks that he uh, wears um, on outings and stuff like that but they don't come back super dirty <laughs> so I really like that and I found these new I was trying those Kellogg's um, bars that they had and then I found these these are Sun Best Pastry Crisp Mixed Berry um, Naturally Favored um, I've never tried these. They say they're new. There's eight uh, pastry crisps in there and it says naturally flavored, no artificial color or dyes, no artificial color. And there's two biscuits in there, um, 100 calories, um, 0 0.5 grams of saturated fat, 70 milligrams of sodium, and 7 grams of sugar, which is not bad. Um, and I would pair this up with like a, a nice tea or maybe some milk. I'm not a milk fan, so I'll definitely pair it up with some almond milk. Um, but these are the nutrition facts here. For two crisps, it's 100 calories. Um, and if you eat like one crisp, it's probably be like 50 calories. So I'm not a fan of eating like two of those. But throughout the day, like for a snack or something, I'll eat the other one. So I'll eat one for the morning because I'm not a big morning breakfast type of person. So I'll try to incorporate that into like maybe some breakfast or something like that. And then I got the Sun's Best um, Pastry Crisp uh, Triple Chocolate. And this is the same as the other one with the nutrition facts. And I actually want to see where this is from. Let's see where it's from. Oh, produced in the Netherlands. Oh my gosh. This is like in another country, like in the, on the UK. Okay, so Netherlands. Okay, so I'm sure these are going to be super good. These are going to be really good, and I can't wait to try these. Guys, you want me to um, do a test, a uh, test, a testing, a uh, taste test on some of the Dollar Tree's um, food items? Let me know because I'm down for it. I'm um, actually going to be doing it anyways, but. If you guys want to see me do it, then let me know. Me and AJJ can do it. But these are going to be really good. And before I open them, I'm definitely going to uh, do a taste test on them in front of you guys. So, anywho, anyways, <laughs> um, <clears throat> this is the end of our vlog. And I hope you guys uh, take all the advice that I gave you for everything into heart. And definitely comment below and check the description box because I'm probably going to have, um, you know, where I got this well basically the Dollar Tree but the name of the products and all that stuff because they have like different names on them so I don't I don't know if your Dollar Tree carries them and then these have like some kind of um, <clears throat> number on them um, so if your Dollar Tree you go in your Dollar Tree and you don't find them you maybe can be like you can't be like there's a home sweet home little house thing on the top of a box you have to have like a number number for it so I'll definitely link that in the description below and then um 
I'll put like everything that I bought in this purchase in my description. So definitely check that out because I have a lot of stuff that I put in my description. I don't know if you guys be going in there that far, but yeah, I really have a lot of stuff there. So anyways, <laughs> um, also I want to do, um, I do want to mention that if you are someone that is sending me, um, uh, let's say links to places where you buy subscribers and you buy thumbs up and you buy all this different kind of stuff. I'm not into that. I don't do that. I want all my cus like all my um subscribers to be organically. Like I want you to come to my channel and be like, okay, yeah, I'm gonna subscribe because I like her. Don't come to my channel because someone is paying you to come to my channel. Um I'm not with that life and yeah, I just wanna say that because somebody did send me a link or something and I actually looked at it. Um because I thought it was some PR and I looked at it and I was like oh no okay it was like something to like some fake subscribers and stuff like that fake likes and all that no I'm not with that I only do my um I do this organically I love when people come to my channel and you have a decision to subscribe or not subscribe I'm not going to pressure you guys um and anyways thank you guys for tuning in um hit that thumbs up if you like and if you like my channel go ahead definitely subscribe because you don't want to miss anything from my channel and turn over your post notifications because you would definitely not know if i put out something and um you'll probably be like oh my goodness i can't believe i missed that you know so make sure you turn on post notifications so that you can get all of my vlogs and have a blessed and beautiful day today it's monday let's rock <laughs>